sneak attack some people. Okay, who? Let's call Brandon. Let's call our gay best friend. I mean, he is constantly on the on the <laughs> boundary, on the, what is it called, defense for our phone calls. He's definitely like, why are they calling me? I hope he's not on a bus again. Hello. Hello. Hi, Brandon. Hi. We're sneak attacking We're you. We're sneak attacking. Hi. Are you on a bus? Yeah. I'm not. I'm Only not true sorry. baddies will understand if he's on a bus or Where not. are you? Um, I'm exercising around my neighborhood. <laughs> oh, perfect. Oh we God. thought you were doing, um, you know, your indoor cardio. I wish. Oh, well, speaking of indoor cardio, Jessica, go ahead. Okay, we have a question for you. Okay. Sorry, this is so blunt. <laughs> we're not sorry. I we asked you about blowjobs on a bus. It's fine. <laughs> have, have you ever had a threesome? Yeah. Oh, Yay! Drink, Cheers, drinking. white clothes. Oh, my God. <laughs> Tell us. Just one. One? How was it? What I, was it? Details, please. It was please. amazing. Um, oh, wow. It was, yeah, it was a few years ago with a married couple, which I thought was fantastic. Whoa. Oh, double <laughs> drink. <laughs> you know, when you're the new equation, you're the star. So. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. How did that go down? Yeah, tell us everything. Go. Um. Well, we met on an app. <laughs> see? You see? Mm -hmm. And then um, I was very nervous because I had never done that. Did you think they were um, going to kill you? Sacrifice you? I didn't you? think that they were going to kill me. I don't know. I was just nervous. So I. So um, is it a male and a female? No. No. <laughs> Hard no. <laughs> no Tracy's gave me the dirtiest. No. Because <laughs> if I know one thing, Brandon is gay in and out. Yeah, but what if Brandon wanted to like be in a three-way to see what it was like with like a weird lady? Do gay guys care about that at all? I mean, or, like, it would depend on the guy, too. Maybe I would want to. <laughs> okay, so, wow. Okay, so it was another couple, two men. You met yes. on an app. Yes. And, like, um, you knew they were a couple. You went to his this? house? Oh, yeah. Um, I knew that they were a couple. So I just, I had them come over. I got very, very drunk because I was very nervous. But it was delightful. <laughs> yes. Oh my God, we love you so much. That's amazing news. Amazing we're trying to, to like a little a bit promote threesomes because we're like, you know, why the fuck not have some fun, live a little, and also like, I don't think it pre it uh, prevents cheating, but I think it like you know gives him like I don't know monogamy's rough, man. You, yeah. you got to have like a release somewhere, you know. So we're like kind of like if you want to try it, like here's our support. Wait, B, did you ever hear from them again? Um, we talked a little bit, but you know, scheduling is tough. <laughs> so. Oh yeah. But yeah, it was very lovely. Um, I definitely recommend it. Yes. Um, wow. Yeah. Fucking love Brandon. <laughs> Brandon, amazing. I honestly That I, was the best sneak attack so far. I know. I can't believe you just openly and honestly just said, Yes, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Look, I know that when you guys call, I have to be honest. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow, I love you. All right, maybe me and Tracy will be honest. We're still considering. <laughs> yeah, tell them the truth. <laughs> All right, have fun on your workout. Get it, get it, get it in. Thank you. I'm going to go drink now. Yay. <laughs> love you, Brandon. Right, love you. Bye. Right, Gay best you. friend. <laughs> Bye. Gay best friend. Man, he really knows what to do. Who are we sneak attacking next? We're calling Alan right now because... No. He's going to kill us. Well, first of all, let me just tell you, Alan's fiance was away for like three months. She came back Monday. Mm -hmm. We uh, haven't heard from him. So no, that means no, he's no, been no. having sex for hours on end. Monday, I probably kept him for like eight hours mm -hmm. of the day and he wanted to murder me. Yeah. And then yesterday, like I called him on speakerphone. I've been harassing him. And Dennis was next to me and went, oh, my God, he sounds so annoyed. He wants to kill you. Yeah. Like, well, he I wants know. to fuck his wife. I know. Like, let him live. I know. All right. Oh, he's going to be so mad. Let's see. I don't know if he's going to be honest. Let's see. I don't, he could cut this. Hello. <laughs> Alan, Hi, are Daddy, you on a Daddy. boat? Hey. Are you on a boat? Uh, no, I just got off the subway. Sounds like you're in Niagara Falls. <laughs> this is a sneak attack. We're sneak attacking you. Tracy, yes. you ask him. We've sne we're sneak attacking you. Have you, have you not ever had a threesome? I have. Oh, yes! Daddy, yes! Daddy, at his best. Cheers. Let's hear it. Cheers. That's a whoa. Yes, whoa. What? <laughs> Tell me now. Uh, I had a few in college. A few? <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. No, let me tell you something. It's the quiet ones. We thought Alan was like this nice, quiet guy that we were corrupting. He's fucking low-key corrupting us. Like, yeah. <laughs> no. Yo, he's crazy, man. Yeah, a few in college? Like, what? 
I mean, the theater program is always. Yeah, no, you just said it. You said the one word, the keyword theater. <laughs> they awesome Everyone, for rakes. Everyone's like, oh, I'm going to be free. And that apparently means, hey, let's fuck you. Let's fuck in the fucking dressing room. That's what that means. Them and the band people. Wow. Thank you for being so honest. You just killed my whole world. I love you so much. That was the best sneak attack. Yeah. We're going to sneak attack a few more people. I'm actually headed into a rehearsal where part of my design is I had to record a fake porn. Wonderful. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Girls, don't underestimate the quiet, cute ones because (laughs) they're the biggest freaks. We love you, Batty. Thanks, Batty Daddy. See you later. Bye. Bye. Call Sammy. (laughs) Let's see. This is going to be epic. She won't pick up. She's definitely fucking. Hello? Oh my god! Oh. Hello. 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 This is a sneak attack from Bad Examples. Hi, it's Tracy and Jessica. <laughs> Hi. We are doing a threesome episode, and we're doing sneak attacks. Are you ever had one? Do you suggest them? What is the deal? I'm hanging up the phone. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, we're white clawing it. We love you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, she's texting me. <laughs> Guys, I can't breathe. Woes and white claws. Oh she goes, God. absolutely not. Stop it. Goodbye. <laughs> she said she it's a work it. Let's, event. Let's do one more person. Who can we think of? <laughs> I'm literally at a work event. She's still texting me. She's so mad. <laughs> so we have one of our baddies that called in, and um, she has a great story. And it seems simple, but it's just so impactful. And this is why we want to tell you about it. Go ahead, Sandra. You can tell your story. Okay. So, um... <laughs> At the time, I had a girlfriend. Me and her got, you know, close. We became friends for a couple of years. And at the time, I was also seeing this guy. We weren't dating, but we were sleeping together. Mm -hmm. And we were drinking, hanging out. And he was like, oh, you guys are so beautiful, blah, blah, blah. Why don't you guys make out? (laughs) So slick. Yeah, we did. So simple. Yeah, we did. And then he joined us, and then things got, you know, a little bit intense, and we started, you know, we had a threesome. We all slept together. I'm not going to lie. It was awesome. I never did anything like that. I always wanted to try it. Mm-hmm. I would never do that with, like, a serious relationship or, like, my husband. I would never do that. You know? Okay, but he was, like, a, a booty call. Yeah, he's like, a booty call. Got it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So um, we did it. It was awesome, whatever. Um, they ended up sleeping over my house. And I woke up, I don't know what time it was, I don't even, <laughs> I wasn't paying attention to it. I woke up to the bathroom, and what, I don't know how, but me and her started going at it again. Uh-huh. <laughs> and then he he woke up, I guess, yeah, because he entered the room, and he thought that he was going to get into the hunt too. And I was, we were like, no. Nah. <laughs> 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 we closed the door. And he kept knocking on the door, like, are you serious? He kept knocking on the door. What? Because we were, like, you know, we were, like, doing our own thing. And I just wow. <laughs> Wait, so he was, like, wait, let me in. And you guys were, like, no, fuck yeah, it. he was knocking on the door, like, really, are you serious right now? And knocking and knocking until he got the point that we were not even answering and we did not open the door. That's <laughs> such a boss move. That is the biggest boss move yeah. ever. I love that so much. That's so good. Wow. Okay, yeah, so he I'll thought he was basically... That. He thought that he was, you guys were in it for him, but then you fucking closed the door on yeah. him in his face yeah. and you were like, you can wait outside, sir. Take several seats. And yeah. that's the beauty like, of a threesome. Sleep or you can go home. Yeah. You don't have to go home, but you got to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> did he leave or did he like jerk off in the other room? Yeah, that too. I should have said that, but I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Oh, my God. That's so funny. Okay, so this is why I love this story, because I feel like most girls who are willing to have a threesome, like kind of just like have heard about it before, want to try it with a girl. And then they use the guy as like a way into it. Uh But then they kick him out because they're like, it really wasn't even about him. It was about me. I've heard that that type of story before where the girls end up getting more into it. And the guy sits back and the girl just enjoys the The guy's like, was I even it was like a friend's episode. He's like, was I even there? (laughs) He's like, I made a sandwich. <laughs> That's amazing. I mean, like for like, I don't want to like make it seem like he was bad. He wasn't. It wasn't that. It's just like you said. It wasn't about him. It was like about me and the hoes. Like we wanted to try it out, and I don't know. I guess. No, we, we like totally get it. I totally we drink get it. To yeah, you. we Cheers. drink to you. Cheers. Woes and white claws. Let's do it. 
Thank yeah, you for sharing. That was story awesome. With us. It seemed so simple, but the real kicker was the closing the door in his face and then locking him out. That was amazing to me. I hope to do that at least once in my life. Yeah, just lock him out. <laughs> Go watch a show. <laughs> We love you, Sandra. Thank you for being a baddie and the best story. Thank you. Thank you, girls. I love you. See, we love you. Bye. Don't forget, guys, new clips air every Thursday. So see you next Thursday. Hosted on dimlywit.com. Even though we are not your best examples, uh, we're the best you've got. So cheers, bitches. Cheers. Make sure you subscribe to our channel for updates. And if you like this clip, share it with a friend.